I am here to answer that question racing through everyone's mind in the grocery store. What products are good and worth my money? I answer this by buying new and interesting products and then recording my in-depth review so that you will know what you are getting. All of this in an attempt to bring it to you full circle. Good evening YouTube, Full Circle Review back here again with another review. This time for a viewer's request. I'm reviewing every variant of the Special K Pastry Crisps. All nutritional information will be at the end of the video for your viewing convenience. I have the Special K Pastry Crisp Brown Sugar Cinnamon, Strawberry, and Blueberry in that box. And then I have the new Caramel Latte, which is the inspiration behind this video. Caffeine equals a half a cup of coffee. We're going to do this last, kind of like a special to get you to watch to the end of the video. But, uh, like I said, nutritional information will be at the end of the video. Someone said that it would be neat to compare these to the Pop-Tart Crisps. I do not see how these are comparable products. Yes, they are bars. Yes, you can put them in your mouth. Yes, they're both made by Kellogg's. But these are focused for entirely different market segments. One is focused towards... Um, Technically, millennials trying to live, relive youth while still maintaining an active lifestyle, and the other ones target specifically towards middle-aged women. Just saying. But, um, I never got on to the Special K. I, I never really ate any of their products because, it, it, in my opinion, their nutritional, inform, nutritional facts never aligned with any diet I supported. Because, I mean, these are 100 calories per package, but it's all carbs. Literally, it's all carbs. Like, I think Pop-Tarts even have more protein than these. Why are you eating these? Just a low-calorie snack? Here's the blueberry. Crispy texture like a toasted Pop-Tart. Nice blueberry jam filling. I retract my previous statement. I understand why you wanted these compared to Pop-Tarts. This is basically a Pop-Tart. My apologies. Jam filling. Has a nice chew and pull to it. A little bit of texture. Wish there was some blueberry pulp in there. The sweetness here is very nice. It's not overpowering, but still, you can. This would feel like a nice sweet dessert. I wish the craft cracker had a more distinct toasted flavor. Stronger notes of vanilla, a little bit of salt. I love the blueberry. Blueberry is on point. Just add some blueberry fiber. Ninety out of one hundred. I would buy that again. Just as a sweet little snack. Now the brown sugar cinnamon. Yeah, th this is basically Pop-Tarts for adults. So you can feel okay about eating Pop-Tarts. Yeah, I don't have any issues with these now. I'm learning. These taste like a brown sugar cinnamon Pop-Tart with a stronger, more peppery cinnamon flavor. I really like it. It's not overly sweet, but it highlights the uncooked, flowery, pie crust-like cracker, which needs to be toasted and salted. Again, notes of vanilla could be appreciated in a stronger brown sugar or molasses pull, and the filling would be appreciated. I prefer a brown sugar cinnamon pop tart over this. I prefer this over the brown sugar cinnamon crisp pop tart, pop -tart though. Because this is not as sweet. 87 out of 100. So now. The strawberry. I wish they did a raspberry or maybe a confetti cake. Or a peanut butter. Peanut butter would have been awesome. With a cocoa cookie cr uh, crust.
very light a little undercooked on the flour needs to be toasted again salt generic berry I could tell the blueberry was blueberry this just tastes like generic berry needs a much stronger strawberry flavor texture is a lot softer I wish it was chewy like the blueberry ones yeah that was just th that's a very poorly constructed bar generic flavor sweetness is alright needs toasted salt vanilla 81 out of 100 blueberry is the winner there so now let's try caramel latte Clean palate. Caffeinated equal to half a cup of coffee. That that is actually pretty interesting. That's basically this is basically a Starbucks drink. This cracker is like a shortbread. It's harder. Almost crunchy. Smells and tastes like a canned caramel latte. Doesn't taste like caramel. Tastes like a caramel latte. Caramel latte flavor is on point. I'm actually impressed. This is one of the most distinct caramel latte flavors I've ever had. If you're a... Um, regular to the channel you know that I've reviewed a lot of Starbucks products the caramel latte flavor in the special K pastry crisp is far superior to most Starbucks drinks I wish it was a more distinct coffee flavor it could be sweeter with a stronger more molasses-y caramel. I like the chew of the filling. I wish the cracker was crispier, not crunchier. And yet it could be toasted. This could benefit from brown sugar. Latte flavors on point. Just wish it was a more natural caramel. I prefer the blueberry, but I'm going to have to give that a 94, 94 out of 100 because the flavor is so spot on. Nonetheless, there has been a review of all the Special K pastry crisps. If you want to see more videos like this, like, share, subscribe, comment down below. Y'all take care.